Stage Curtain Flame Testing Much confusion exists about stage curtain flame testing. This video will answer some of the most common questions we receive about flame testing procedures and flame retardancy in stage curtain fabrics. What exactly does the term flame retardant mean? Other common terms you might hear are fire retardant or fire resistant, but they all mean the same thing. Flame retardant, or FR, means the fabric passes the applicable tests to inhibit flame propagation, most commonly the NFPA 701 test. We often use the term FR to mean combustible natural fiber fabrics that have been chemically treated. However, FR really includes any fabric which meets the applicable standards. Flame retardant curtains have to be retreated to maintain their fire retardancy if they get wet. It's difficult to retreat them. Inherently flame retardant, IFR, is a specific subset of FR. IFR means the FR properties are inherent to the yarn rather than being contained in a topical treatment which can break down or be removed. IFR curtains never need to be retreated, plus they're cleanable with a damp cloth. Being able to easily clean your curtains is great, especially if your theater is one which is used by children. No curtain is fireproof. Any fabric will burn given enough heat. What's the difference between 701 and 705 testing? The National Fire Protection Association, NFPA, has established methods for testing fire propagation in hanging fabrics such as stage curtains. Article 701 defines procedures for two laboratory tests. Method 1 applies to most stage fabrics weighing 21 ounces per square yard or less, as actually weighed, not as manufacturer advertised. Method 2 is for all vinyl-backed fabrics and fabrics weighing over 21 ounces per square yard. 701 tests are very exacting laboratory tests that require strict adherence to precise laboratory procedures, special testing jigs, specific pre-test conditioning, and a statistical analysis of the results. 701 tests yield the most accurate and most reliable results of any form of flame testing. New stage curtains should only be constructed from fabrics with acceptable NFPA 701 test results. Due to confusion in the entertainment industry regarding flame tests, it's helpful to understand the history of NFPA flame testing. It's just a short history lesson, don't worry. Prior to 1989, Article 701 contained a large-scale laboratory test and a small-scale field test method. Field tests, by their very nature, yield less consistent and less accurate results. The pre-1989 article was frequently misinterpreted to mean either method was acceptable. To improve the standard, 701 was revised into Method 1 and Method 2, and the small-scale test procedure was removed. So, can stage curtains still be field tested? Yes, since the need for a field test procedure still existed, a poor test is better than no test at all, Article 705 was created. 705 is a destructive test, like 701, but it's much simpler to conduct and more procedural latitude is given to allow for varying field conditions. It's common for people to mistakenly refer to 701 small scale, the test which was abolished in 1989, rather than the current 705 standard. While the actual test procedures are very similar, 705 does a much better job of clarifying the limitations of the field test. How often should stage curtains be flame tested? Theater curtains should be tested annually to verify they meet NFPA 705 standards. If any samples fail or produce questionable results, the curtain should be removed or a 701 test should be performed. How is a 701 test conducted? In many cases, a 701 test is simply not a viable option. It requires 10 large fabric specimens. Specimens must be taken throughout the curtain and must not be taken from or near a selvage edge. If the first 10 specimens yield inconsistent results, a second set of 10 specimens may be required. In other words, to perform a 701 test, you have to cut huge holes in your curtain, which may not have a desirable outcome. The amount of damage done to the curtain by removing this many specimens can be impractical to repair. In cases where the curtain has historical significance, is very large or ornate, and there is a reasonable belief the specimens will pass, it may be a consideration. Bellatex offers complete 701 testing and repair services, and we're happy to discuss your specific project. 
How is a 705 test conducted? NFPA 705 makes it clear that the field test is an exclusionary test. In other words, it doesn't confirm that the materials are safe or that they will pass a 701 test. However, it can demonstrate that they will not. A material that fails a 705 test will, without a doubt, fail a 701 test and clearly possess unacceptable flame propagation properties. A passed 705 test indicates very little as items that do not burn under 705 conditions may burn under 701 conditions or in an actual fire. The 705 test procedure is number 1. Remove a suitable sample of the material to be tested half an inch by four inches or greater. Number two, in a safe location with no draft, expose the sample to a flame from a common kitchen match or other similar source for 12 seconds. Finally, remove the flame. The sample should self-extinguish within two seconds. Less than four inches of sample should have been consumed and drippy fireballs, if any, should self-extinguish upon or before contact with the ground. Can I test my own curtains? Before conducting any test, we strongly recommend you obtain, read, and understand the actual NFPA 705 document. Contact your local Bellatex dealer to test your curtains for you. Typically, there's no charge for this service. Bellatex offers free NFPA 705 testing by mail, and a full range of NFPA 701 testing packages are available for a fee. Should you choose to test your curtains yourself, it is really very simple. All you have to do is take a small piece of fabric, hold it a few inches over a flame, and see how fast it burns. If you need a certificate showing that the curtains have been flame tested to have on hand for your local fire marshal, contact us and we can help you find a local dealer who can assist you in testing your curtains. If you are unsure about the flame retardancy of any of your stage curtains, or if it has been more than 12 months since they were last tested, Call us and we'll arrange for one of our professional local dealers to stop by. They can test and evaluate your curtains for you and update the labels to reflect the new test date. In most cases, there is no charge for this service. We hope to have answered your questions about flame testing. For further questions, contact us at 1-800-372-3373. Thanks for watching.